Hello. Well, today is December the 21st, 2016, which means that today is the day of the winter solstice. Although, if you're one of my Southern Hemisphere viewers, then it's the day of the summer solstice. So, what actually is the winter solstice? Well, in simple terms, it's the day when the sun reaches its furthest south above the earth. So, the earth isn't actually level with respect to the sun. It's tilted at about 23 degrees. This means that at certain times of the year, the sun can be directly above a place further south than the equator. And we call this the Tropic of Capricorn. So, if you're on the Tropic of Capricorn today, then the sun is directly overhead. So the biggest places on the Tropic of Capricorn are probably Sao Paulo and Rio de Janeiro in Brazil. But it also goes in places in South Africa and Northern Australia. Now, the equivalent place in the Northern Hemisphere, which it takes place in June, is the Tropic of Cancer. Now they're named after the constellations that the sun used to be in about 2,000 years ago when the winter and the summer solstice respectively took place. Today they happen in Sagittarius in the south and in Taurus in the north. The winter solstice also represents the shortest day here in the northern hemisphere and the longest in the southern. So if you're somewhere high latitude like me in England then the sun will rise here and stay up only as far as here. So you can see that the sun will have travelled through a lot less than 180 degrees and so the sun will be up for a lot less than 12 hours. And in fact if you're at very high latitudes inside this imaginary line here which is called the Arctic Circle then the sun won't rise for you at all today. You'll have darkness all day long and that occurs if you're north of certain places in Alaska in Canada, in Greenland, Norway, Sweden, Finland and Russia. Conversely, if you're south of the Antarctic Circle, the equivalent place in the Southern Hemisphere, then you'll have the sun up all day long, the so-called midnight sun. The situation six months later is we have the June solstice, the summer here in the Northern Hemisphere, and you'll see that the same place has sunrise here and the sun stays up all the way around and finally sets over here. You can see it's a lot more than 180 degrees and so that the sun will stay up for a lot longer than 12 hours. And if you're north of the Arctic Circle then you've got the midnight sun. The sun's up all day long. So, thanks for watching and happy Solstice Day!